morning. It's 8.21. We just made it to our first pickup of the day. We have a nine o'clock appointment. And of course, we're here early. So he's greasing his bearings. Now it's gonna be 104 today. So hopefully we finish before it gets too hot. It's gonna be hot. Yes. Now, as you notice, he's now wearing long sleeve, the white long sleeve. I've always wore long sleeve, but these here are um, dry fit, very, um, very cool material. And they're at Costco. Here, do me a favor, can you pump this? He gets them at Costco, they have them on sale. Quite grab often two, for ten dollars. Grab it with two hands. Hold on, hold on. Go ahead. Hold on. Do it again. Oh, it's not going to go. Again. Okay. Again. Again. Okay. So very cool dry fit material. Ten dollars at Costco. And they have them in several different colors. A Dodge Journey, and the employee doesn't think it runs. So I'm gonna go ahead and try it out and see. We can always use a winch. This is the vehicle, and there's no power. Looks like it's been sitting for quite some time. But when I put the key in, there's nothing. So he's gonna go ahead and bring the jumpers and see if we can give it a jump. He's plugging up the jumpers. And we have power. The SUV is loaded and um, strapped down. It has transmission problems, but he was able to load it on the trailer without any issues. Now when we get to our next location, he'll have to unload it and reload it. It's 9 a.m. We just arrived at our second location of the day. Over here we're going to pick up two vehicles. Now the appointment here is at 9.30. So meanwhile, he's going to go ahead and unload the Dodge. And then he'll go check in to see if there's any possibility that he can uh, get the vehicles before 9.30. So we, have, we went ahead and unloaded the Dodge, parked it here. There's still plenty of room to get cars onto the trailer. Now he's going to go and uh, check in to see if they can possibly take them before the appointment time. they don't open until 9 30 so now he has 15 minutes so what he's going to do meanwhile is he takes out his straps and rolls them and puts them here on the trailer in the areas that he's going to need them that way they're already they're going to be easy for him to strap the vehicles what's the temperature today it's going to be 104 it's currently 83 but the sun is hot i could already feel it Ah, so can I? It's gonna be hot. In our first videos, these straps were nice and brand new, nice and shiny. They're definitely not. They're definitely not new any longer. You know why? They get dirty. The tires. The tires are very dirty. Yeah, of course. Especially recoveries. You never know where they, they've been or been sitting. What time is it? You have 10 minutes. This is his 610 jack. What type of jack is that? Canister jack, isn't it? It's a, uh, 
on. It's a bottle jack. Oh, bottle jack. I was thinking canister. Going the truck, we're gonna check the brakes real okay. quick. Please. Yeah. So I'm gonna go ahead and go in the truck and he's gonna check the brakes. ahead and put on the handbrake first I did the foot brake but then that didn't make sense I put the handbrake on which the handbrake to me is is what's the trailer brake Brakes were good. Did the driver's side? Now he's going to go ahead and do the passenger side. Again, the we're going to take the brakes. So, again, I'm going to get in the truck and then go ahead and test the brakes. I'm going to need a new sock. Look at all that grease. Next one or no? Yeah, I can do the next one. It's tricky. Just, oh. just guide me over here. All right. The next one has transmission issues, so because I was giving it a lot of gas and it might accidentally hit this car. I tried cleaning the windows with the windshield wiper, but the windshield wipers are in poor condition. Anytime you say we're gonna use hooks, they gotta be ready. Oh. It was my idea to use a hook and I didn't have them ready. Back up a little, a little bit. Stops. Okay, go forward about one inch. You gotta give it a lot of gas. A lot of gas. Stop. That's good. currently 86 here in Modesto and it's going to be over 100 degrees for the next few days. I need 
water. I just drank some. Yeah. You drank <laughs> some, but thank you for offering. Thank you, thank you. I'm still thirsty. I'm gonna have a heat stroke. I'll get your water. All right, thank you. <laughs> Thirsty. Yeah. Can you open it? I got gloves on. Thank you. What the? Uh, Are you finished? Yeah. Uh, better. All three vehicles are delivered and it's eighty eight degrees. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, please drop them below. And again, thank you.